Video games, to me, are a very important thing. They have helped me through countless rough times throughout my life. But recently, something has just felt off. Video games just aren't hitting the same as they did up to, say, three years ago. It's a really, really hard feeling to describe, but they just aren't as fun. Recently, I found myself not even having the motivation to start a game, or if I do start it, I drop it within an hour. For example, I played Resident Evil 4 for the first time, thought it was great. 20 minutes later, I quit and told myself, I'll come back to it. It's been four days, and I can't even find the will to play it again. I would like to go back in time to my history with gaming to get a feel of what has changed. My first ever game I ever played was Pokemon Gold. Gifted to me by my mother when I was merely five, I fell in love with it and everything gaming. I then got into Mario and Animal Crossing soon later. I played them religiously. Whenever my sister wasn't using the GameCube for her Animal Crossing, I would hop on and play mine, to my heart's content. I loved it. Whenever someone wasn't using the computer, I would look up New Super Mario Bros. walkthroughs so I could beat the game. I continued gaming, even though I was shamed for it by many, many people, even my own father. By the way, fuck you, dad. A few months after I got into gaming, my parents unfortunately divorced. But what kept me busy and distracted from the whole ordeal? You guessed it, gaming. By then I was playing Animal Crossing City Folk and a bunch of N64 games. Continuing on, I got more and more consoles, more and more games, and more and more unforgettable experiences. I will never forget the first time I encountered a shiny Pokemon. Even if it was the guaranteed red Gyarados in Pokemon Soul Silver, I still couldn't believe my eyes. My first dub in Fortnite with my friend Nick, or even my first attempt at speedrunning Mario Odyssey and gain a better time than I ever expected to. Fast forward all the way up to 17. This was my peak of being hyped for games. Smash Ultimate was getting close to being released. Hate me for this, but Fortnite with the gang was always a blast. The Binding of Isaac had started taking over my life. I was replaying a bunch of N64 and GameCube games. It was so magical. So, what happened? What happened to all those magical times? Games just don't feel the same anymore. Gaming is near and dear to my heart and always will be, so why can't I find the spark to play more games? Maybe it has to do with growing up. All of my friends and I have jobs now. We rarely get to hang out and play games. I'm always too tired to play games. Hell, even working on scripts like this one for videos have made me tired recently. Games are meant to be fun, but recently, they have felt like nothing but a struggle for me. I should be playing more games. I'm still young. I shouldn't have to worry about the struggles of life just yet, but for some reason, I still just can't find the motivation to game anymore. And it's not like I'm low on games to play. I just can't find any motivation to play most of the games I own. Here's a few examples. Here's the amount of games I own on my Xbox One. Now here's the amount of games I actually play if I'm feeling up to it on my Xbox One. Here's my N64 collection of games. Here are the games I rarely play. As you can see, it's a genuine struggle to play any game that crosses my mind. Hell, I never play my Switch anymore. I thought I was never going to get bored of that. Never get bored of Smash Ultimate, never get bored of Breath of the Wild, never get bored of Mario Odyssey, but four years later, I never play it anymore unless I'm with a friend. And even then, it just doesn't feel the same as it did back in the day. Back in the day, that's another thing. Snow days. Whenever there was a snow day and there was no school, I would always hop on Minecraft, Fortnite, or whatever else with the boys. But what do I do now? I sleep. I sleep because I have to work. Gaming, as I mentioned, is a very important thing to me. And I'm going to continue gaming whenever I can because I never want to give it up. Not after it has helped me through so much. Nothing can beat the magic of getting close to the TV when I was younger and gluing my eyes on Paper Mario and Hey You Pikachu. So where did all that magic go? That was the question I was dead set on answering in this video. Well, I think it has to do with the evolution of life itself. Not having time, always being busy, not having the motivation, not being able to bring yourself to play a single game. Hell, the only games I truly enjoy playing at the moment are Friday Night Funkin', Rhythm Heaven, some Pokemon games, and occasionally Minecraft. That isn't a lot, and eventually those games are going to become tiring like all the others. 
And what will I do then? Find other games to play? Probably not, because I just don't have the will to. I really, really wish I could go back to 2017. Playing Mario Odyssey and Breath of the Wild for the first time, hopping on Fortnite with the boys, getting hyped about Smash. Those were the days. And unfortunately, I can't go back. But I will always, always treasure those memories. Even if gaming does become blank to me, those memories will always have a special place in my heart. Forever.